Hi everyone, Nevada Nail Person, and I have another Mimi box. And as I've stated before, Mimi box is a box you just see it on the website, you purchase it, and it hits your door. Of course, you got to pay for it. But um, these are some Mimi boxes. There's been some changes. They're not being shipped from Korea anymore. It's coming from the United States. So I am just going through them and um, sharing with you because some of these products would still be available, could be still be available on their website. They do now have an app for Mimi Box where you can purchase their products right on the app. So if you um, are interested in these products, certainly check out their app. It is an Android app at this time. Um, so sure, check them out and I will go through the products with you. Mimi Box certainly has some great products. So, um, definitely look into it. Hopefully they'll still be available. Hopefully my faves will still be available. So um, let me just jump in and share with you. So this is the Princess Edition number no. 5 Tinkerbell box. And it says that, and let me just read the little quote up here. We're spellbound by the prettiest pixie Tinkerbell. Add a touch of glitter to the eyes and lips for an understated yet beautiful eye-catching shine. Or go all out and amp up the intensity with sparkle flecked shimmers. You choose. Follow the fairy trend and highlight and illuminate your body and face minus the excess shine with pearl based luminizers that give you an enchanting glow. Shimmer and glitter in makeup can be overwhelming. Yes, they can. But with the help of our fabulous Mimi Boxers and Tink herself, we created this Tinkerbell box for all day, every day, wear. So let's just make sure that is what they're telling us. So let's see what we have. One, two, three, four, five, six full-size items. Yay. Um, so this box was probably around $30. I did buy it in a bundle of three. So it was a probably, probably a little bit less, probably more around the 20 point range. Um, so this first product is called, it's by a company, Body Net, and it's the Clavy S Cream, full size, and it's worth $8. And it says that, um, gently massage the cream over the neck and collarbone area. So it is a, an illuminator for the neck area. So... Not that I'm going to be hitting any balls tonight, um, but let's see what exactly this is. This is certainly not something I think I would normally purchase unless it's a multitasking product. And it looks like that in the jar. So actually it looks like an opalescence type product. Let me just try it right there. So it's not really coming out very well on camera. It is just a little shimmer, a little glow. It's it's not even showing up on camera. But that's what it is, just that, a little shimmer. So I'm sure you could use it anywhere. Um, so that's interesting. That's certainly different. Oh, but it does have some glitter. I see some sparkling. I don't think you'll catch it on camera. So, um... Definitely getting some sparkle. Don't love that. This next product is by Riri. And it's a pigment. And it's randomly selected from Gold Clutch or Peach Peach Peach. And it retails for $12. And let's see what I got. I can't see this print is so tiny. This is, let's see what color it is. Peach Peach. Well, that's nice. I think I would like that. Ooh, you know, oh, this looks like a one of those L'Oreal Infallible eyeshadow type pots. Oh, look at that. Can you see that? Let's try this. It is kind of chunky. Um, let's see if we can get it. There it is on my finger. And I'm going to swatch it here. So there is the shimmer. 
So it says it's a pigment, but it is kind of chunky. I'm getting little glitter particles. But it is a very, very pretty color. Um, I don't want to... I don't... This stuff spills. I, I'm not a fan of pigments. But it is rather pretty, I must say. It's perfect for a wash of color. Um, if I want to be all sparkly on a Saturday, why not, right? So that's kind of neat. And I said that retails for $12. This next product is by a company, Vivido. This is the Blues Shiny Primer. And it retails for $34. And it says, apply a thin coat of primer all over the face to prep. So, okay, um, so it's a primer, let's take a peek, and I'm wondering if, it, if it's, it does have a blue base, I'm trying to get my glasses down, um, it's a radiant, so there's a radiance to this, so let's see if I can show you. Oh, see, it does come, there is a slight blue tinge to it, and I guess that's why it's blue's shiny primer. Um, but it's more of a purple. Um, actually, it's a interesting scent. It's almost citrusy. Um, so it's a primer. I'm not getting any radiance that I can see on the light right now. But, hey, a primer. I can always use a primer. Interesting. So that is a primer, and that retails for $34. I said that already. So, yay for primers. Um, again, I'm not getting any shimmer on that. So, even if I used a BB cream or a, 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 um, a foundation, it probably wouldn't show through anyway. This next product is by a Company Revison, they do a lot of Mimi Box's makeup. This is the Moisture Shine Lip Gloss, and it's randomly selected from white or sandy beige. So let's see what I got. This must be sandy beige. And this retails for, let me see. This retails for $16, um, so it's just a lip gloss applied directly to lips. I do see a slight sheen shimmer in there, a um, little bit of a glitter effect. I'm a little, we'll see how, I'm not going to open a lip gloss right now. I have so many lip products open right now. Um, but that is certainly a natural enough color and probably a nice color to layer on top of like if you just want to look with the lip liner and just put a little gloss on. So that's actually kind of nice. I'm interested to see what the white would have looked like. Um, probably like an opal, I would think. Um, so that's nice. Another lip gloss. This next product is... Hmm. This is the... This is by Tony Moly. And this is the Crystal... Tear Glitter Eyeliner in number 101 white retails for $7. And it says, draw, uh, draw in along your tear line where your lower eyelashes are to finish off eye makeup. Oh, so it's an inner corner highlighter. Highlighter. Eyeliner? Did I say that? I guess it could be eyeliner. So, oh, interesting. So I never had anything like this before. Let's see if I can open this up. Oh, this is really safe. Okay. Sealed. So, let's see. So, it's just a like a liner type pen. And it's just that white. And I'm not going to do a... You don't want to see a close-up of these eyes. So, um, I may be getting a new camera. I'm going to look into that. So, maybe I would be more comfortable in close-ups and doing showing nail applications. Um, so there it is on my hand. So that would be kind of fun to have that too, because um, sometimes in your daily kit you just have um, 
another like a pot of shadow that you use for inner corner highlighting. Um, sometimes the palettes you use don't have the um, brightening shade that you would need for the inner corner. So they have the product right there. So this is actually kind of nice and it does buff out a little so you just get a little bit of shimmer. Really nice. Love that. And that retails, I think I said, $7. Final product is by company Maison and it's Oh Shy Glow on Shimmer Light. And it says to use the attached brush to apply a small, small amount of the highlighter over T-zone, C-zone, dark circles, and wherever you wish to add more 3D radiance. Okay, so um, this retails for $14. So let's see what this has. Oh my, they really... Oh, here, on the bottom I could open it. <laughs> A box challenged. So here is... Um, oh, and is it a powder? So here's what the product look like, looks like. Um, let's see. Oh, it, it, it has a brush similar to like a nail polish. You know what? It reminds me of, I think it's Benefit that have these highlighters in like a little jar that looks like nail polish. So it is a highlighter. It looks kind of opalescent. There it is. And there it is buffed out. So it's just a highlighter. So that would be nice to add to, like they said, your T-zone, C-zone. So that's your C zone. So that's interesting. Love that. So that is everything in my Tinkerbell box. So if you have any questions, as always, let me know and I will talk to you soon. Bye.